Hey guys, this one says solve for X and it gives us some pretty crazy looking equations with X's and Y's. There are several different ways to solve this, but I wanna show you my favorite one. It uses the difference of two squares. So if you have A squared minus B squared, it's equal to A plus B times A minus B. And we do have that going on right here. X to the fourth minus Y to the fourth, that is a difference of two squares. So we can use this formula. We need to find the square root of X to the fourth, that is X squared. And then we're gonna do plus and minus. And then the square root of Y to the fourth is Y squared. Let's copy both of these down. And this can be factored based on this. That's going to be x plus y, x minus y. And from here, we can plug stuff in. x to the fourth minus y to the fourth is 671. Now let's give ourselves some parentheses for this side. x squared plus y squared is equal to 61. And then x plus y will leave as x plus y. And x minus y is equal to 1. If we divide both sides by 61, this left-hand side is 11. And on the right-hand side, all we have left is the x plus y. So we've solved for x plus y, but we need to solve for x. So we can pull this bottom one down, which is 1 equals x minus y. And if we add these two rows together, 11 plus one is 12, x plus x is 2x, and then y minus y goes away. The Bible sides by two, and we get x equals six. And that is the answer to the question. How exciting.